In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to wallet track and copy trade within the Axiom Pro trading platform. In the description of this video, there'll be a link to Axiom Pro and that will give you 10% discounted trading fees. And that'll also allow you to potentially receive airdrops from me in the future. If you're still trading on old platforms like Bullex, Photon and Trojan Bot, then you're at a massive disadvantage because Axiom Pro are constantly shipping out lots of new features all the time. And these features are going to give you that slight edge over a majority of traders not using Axiom Pro yet. So let's get started. Once you've clicked the link in the description and you've opened up Axiom, you're going to want to head on over to Wallet Tracker in the bottom left hand corner. Once you've clicked that, that will then open up your Wallet Manager. So make sure you're on this Wallet Manager tab and you can either add your own wallets that you want to copy trade. So just enter in their wallet address, put in the name of the trader that you're copying. You can also select a nice little emoji if you'd like to do that too. And then just click add wallet. But what you can also do is you can import a list of wallets in this box here. I will also leave a list of the top traders currently on Solana where there'll be hundreds of wallets that you can copy trade. If you click my telegram link in the description, you will see a text file in there called Solana wallets to copy trade. Once you've opened that up, copy and paste the whole text file into this box here. You can do that by clicking control A and control C and then control V in this box here. Click import and then you will have a list just like mine full of the top current wallets trading on Solana. By clicking the six dots up here, you can also drag this box and snap it to the edge of your screen. And by clicking this bell icon, that will alert you when the trader makes a trade. And you can then go on over to the live trades and you can see all of the live trades that your wallets are currently taking. So you can see the name of the wallet here. If you hover over, it'll also give you a brief description of what they've done. So you can see this trader has done one buy of $390 and one sell, and you can see their current PNL on that trade. You can then see the token that they're currently trading. You can see how old the token is and the amount of Solana that they've traded. You can then also see the current market cap of that token. Now here is where you can quickly buy. So you can quick buy and enter a trade at the same time that they do. And to change this setting, you just wanna come on over to here where the lightning bolt is and just adjust the amount of Solana that you want to enter that trade with. And then as you can see, it is now changed and we can enter with just dot one Solana. Here is your preset button. So you can click this or you can come on over to the bottom left hand button and select preset one. Once you've clicked that, these are your trading settings. So you can just copy these settings. These are the most optimal settings that I personally use. 20 slippage, 0.01 priority, and 0.01 bribe. You then wanna make sure that is the same on the sell side. So copy and paste those settings in there. You can, if you want to, adjust the MEV. So you can have full protection by clicking secure, or you can turn MEV completely off. This depends on your trading style. A lot of traders will have this off if they want to enter a trade nice and fast, especially if you already have high slippage. However, you can play around with these settings if you don't want to get sandwiched on a transaction. If you don't need to be fast, then you can certainly opt for MEV protection. So those are the trading settings for buy and sell. And you've also got different custom presets you can use. So once you've done that, just hit continue. And that is how you wallet track and copy trade within Axiom Pro. If you found this tutorial useful, Please leave a like rating and subscribe to the channel. I'll be posting more tutorials just like this one.